Trying to talk about koala. It's about to f her day up, and I am about it. <laughs> hey, get him! Get him! The other day we found a kitten against our garage and we couldn't find its mother anywhere, so we brought it in. We offered him some water and realized that he was using his paw to determine the depth because he couldn't see. He seemed to be comfortable around us, so we decided to keep him in the garage while we went to the store to get him some food. He didn't seem too sure about it in the beginning, but after a couple of bites, he was a fan. We cleaned up his eyes the best we could for the first night and played with him for a little bit before we got him settled into bed. The next morning we went to the vet to get his eyes looked at to see if we can do something to help. They cleaned him so well, and then told us that there was an infection that we needed to see if we can't fix to restore his vision. We brought him home with some medications and an appointment for an ophthalmologist for the next day, so we brought him home to get some rest. By the next morning, he was- Come on, come on, baby. Come on, sweetheart. Yeah, look at you. Sweetheart. It's like a whole new cat. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's for sure. Jose and I stayed on top of his treatments with the eye drops every two hours and his antibiotics. Good boy. That's a good boy. Then it was time for breakfast before we headed to the ophthalmologist to get his eyes looked at again. He wasn't a big fan of the car at first. But after a few minutes, he got comfortable and settled down. After picking up a couple new medications, we went back home to settle in for a couple weeks to see if this will help. On Thursday, we go back in for his follow-up appointment to determine if we'll need to do surgery on his eyes or if they can be saved at all. We'll be back in a couple of days with an update for you all.